Good morning everyone, welcome back to Stardew Valley. Last day of summer jellyfish time. Hello, Lana. Good morning, little one. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Yes, queen of sauce. Uh, roasted hazelnuts. I've got a nice old hazelnut tree behind my house and every year I invite the family over for a nut roasting party. Once we start roasting, it's inevitable that the neighbors will show up. That rich, nutty smell is irresistible. Now, here's the family recipe. Yay, roasted hazelnut. Great. Hey, Abigail. Uh, Hipsy, heading out into the wild. I got you something. Yeah, fried mushrooms. Sure thing, honey. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, let's see. I installed a little bit, but I don't know if it worked. Okay, we'll find out. In okay, Tom soup. Where is the roasted hazelnut thingy? I'm almost complete on this side. I think only this one is missing, and the rest of them is just missing ingredients. Those are almost full. Ah. Okay, I only need three hazelnut. Oh, that's great. And since tomorrow it's going to be fall, I will have a lot of hazelnut to collect. Yipsy, you're such a good neighbor. I thought I'd send you over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up. Marnie. Oh, uh, that reminds me I need to, more, need to gather more hay. Tonight at around 10 o'clock p.m. a rare and beautiful event will take place. Yes, the Moon of Chandlies. I find it interesting that this is the only time Demetrius actually invites you to a festival and not Major Lewis. Probably because he is... Probably because he is uh, the bio, bio dog and knows what's going to happen with nature. So yeah. Uh, okay, last harvest. And I think by tomorrow the rice plants will be gone. Okay. Oh, Those blueberries won't make it in time. Those aren't even grown yet. Or wait. Oh, oregano. Okay. So those were ready. Okay, let's sell a few things. A warm and aromatic yet slightly bitter herb in the mint family. I'm just going to sell them. Okay, and... Yeah, you're right, I didn't place them back in there. Okay, good. I was kind of tired last time. And I ran out of space in my inventory, apparently. Okay, um, I even have one hazelnut. I think I'm going to remove the lower quality stuff. And I'm going to place you in here. I might make some casks later. Cakes, casks. Whatever. <laughs> okay, there we go. Ah. Uh. Summer is at its end. Slobber! Hey, little guy. How are your trees going? Slobber has a nice little place of shade. Okay, oh, right. Uh, there. I'm gathering all the stuff so I won't lose any. By the time oh. fall rolls around, it would be sad if that happened. Okay, done. And we don't have really that much space in our inventory left, so I guess I'm going to drop more of this stuff in here and just sell this one. Sell you, you, you. I'm going to prepare the snail. Oh, 
also going to sell this one. Okay. Ah, why is everyone blocking my path? Um, can I make? Oh yeah, I still have had some garlic. Radish salad, yeah, one. Coleslaw, one. Pumpkin, nah. Root platter, it's very useful. I could. I wanted to try something. Uh, I guess I wanted to make a cheese board or something like that. Algia soup just pop up, popped up because the game apparently remembered. Oh yeah, right. I still have some algia in my inventory somewhere. Oh yeah, mustard. I wanted to make mustard even though it completely wastes away all the stuff. Um, I still have eggs, so I could make a lot of fried eggs. Omelette uses up milk and eggs. So I'm going to make a void egg. Oh, yeah, right. Never made salad, I think, so... Golden quality omelette. Nice. Parsnip soup. Hash browns and pancakes. Potato and oil. I don't have any eggs anymore. Okay. Well. Okay, um... Abigail, why do you insist on stand? Why is everyone standing in my way? Blueberries, going to place those in here. Sorry, Abigail, please let me through. <laughs> I don't like it when I have to shove my my people away just to get to the door. But sometimes they just don't want to move. Uh, I have a lot of geodes. Oh yeah, that reminds me, I should have checked my luck. Uh, a quick multiple pet. Always keep your animals happy. That makes them produce higher quality of their stuff. <laughs> and I kind of like it when they make their sound in union. Okay, so these guys are happy. Oop, lazuli, please move a little. Thank you. It feels like the grass is working really well. They don't really manage to eat all of them away. So I hope that this solved my little grass problem of, bu of buying a grass starter constantly and if not well it's going to at least last a little longer oh hey and this actually worked okay place you in here you can't place the hay inside the silo but you can place it in when you have one of those fodder bins Okay, I saw this correct. Yay! Ruffle! Good, that means we can make some amazingly expensive mustard. Move! <laughs> ah. Come on guys, stop being in my way. this one and this one I'm going to keep this cheese just to make a few of those recipes and oh cream waddles and snuffles are now cranking the game up a little bit <laughs> Because I think yesterday they didn't dig up any truffle. And today they're really, really working on it. Um, yeah, I still have some inventory space. This looks interesting. Strawberries, my blueberries, my coffee. Mm. <laughs> okay, and 
and Okay, still have enough space for those. Okay. I kind of planted uh, those irregular. Still have, oh yeah, right. No space in my inventory left. Um, so I'm going to plant one here, when, one here and one there, I guess. And then we're going to take the 13 star fruits and see how many spaces we can fill with those. The amount of star fruit I have in my greenhouse is constantly shrinking. Simply because I keep replacing them with ancient seed. With ancient fruits. Which is kind of nice. Um, I think that should be enough. I hope. Okay, four, five, eight. Okay, so I had an average of two per per fruit. That is okay. And those go in. Just going to drop this one in here as well. All right. Good. I could try to empty my trees. But I'm not feeling like it right now. Um going to place those in here. Going to remove those. And I didn't really have any coffee in here. More star fruit wine. Oh yeah, right, I still had a gold milk. I need to bring it back. Removing one. So it is the correct amount. And let's see, I don't have... Oh yeah, I have cranberries in here, but I only have higher quality, so... Yeah. And I didn't bring any of my gathered coal and stuff in over there. I'm going to turn one of those into oil and the other one will be used for the recipe. And before we do that, um, sell, 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 sell. The numbers will go immensely uh, high thanks to the starfruit wine. And this one and this one. Good. I should drop the stone. I don't know why I can keep carrying around stone. <sighs> Abigail, why do you why is everyone so insistent on standing right at the entrance? Um mustard. And it's iridium quality thanks to the truffle. Um, and for this one I'd need salami which is beef and pork. Since uh, it somehow doesn't link to the fridge which I kind of hoped it would do. Doesn't work out as well as I liked it but yeah it's okay. We can work with it still and let's see. Uh, whoops. Mm. Okay, one salami. I don't have bread, so I'm going to make one. And that makes a cheese board. And I want it. Oh, I need oil. Okay. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. There we go. Please move. That's what we have our oil maker. This one is really useful. Once you have sap. Put it in there, wait 20 minutes in game, <laughs> which isn't very long. And sap oil, which replaces regular oil and it's far easier to, to get. Okay, now we can make a corn dog. I hope that this will sell rather well. Yeah, I, I kind of doubt it. It takes lo a lot of stuff. And use it, uses it. And one bacon, please. Okay, I think we almost made every single one of those recipes we had in here. Except for the cheeseburger. I kinda refuse to make the cheeseburger. Oh yeah. And this one, the barbecue sauce. Alright. 
goat milk, tomato, strawberry. Going to remove you. Tomato, strawberry, peach, wine, orange wine, coconut wine. I'm going to keep at least one of those. I don't know. I, I kind of feel like I will get a quest that requires me to have starfruit wine. I'm not sure. I think I remember something along these lines. And I bet that if I place tomatoes in in one of those casks, it would make like tomato juice or something like that. Which would be, I guess, an equivalent to ketchup. I'm not sure of that. And those go in here. I'd like to put at least two of those coffee beans aside. Just to make sure that I don't actually lose all the coffee beans and turn them into something. Yeah. Go in here. Okay. I'm just going to take you with me. Because I can. And I will. And I would. Alright. You don't really have to spend any time waiting for... 10 p.m. Once you have uh, of your farm at this size, it, it just comes natural. You look at the clock and oh my god, it's already this late. So you don't really have to wait or anything. Because you're so busy trying to... Whoops. Trying to uh, get all the stuff done you have going on your farm. It, it just works. And I'm going to start lay, placing a path down here so the so the trees don't uh, grow into my field all the time. I really have to put, lay down a path. Best done with stone, because I have so many. Okay. Even if I stand right beneath the tree and don't catch all of them. Good. Now we have some room. Again. Some well needed room. Hmm. Haven't been here for a while, I guess. Oh, it's Sunday. That means that the traveling merchant is, uh, in the forest. All right. So we're going to visit her as well. And place those in here. They're producing slime eggs on a regular basis. Now, thanks to the sheer amount of slimes I have, I guess. And you. And all right. This goes in here. Please let me through. Thank you. Boop, 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 boop. Close. And this goes in here. Good. Um, it's six. That means we still have enough time in order to make it to the guild and get claim our prize for slaying all the coals from yesterday and. You know, garlic, cave okay, fish, tulip, large artichoke, puffer fish. Mm. Nah. Nothing interesting here. No wally. <laughs> I'm going to take the scenic route, I guess. Hmm. Oop. Too far. Okay, it's 7. They close at 10 and the festival will start at 10, so this is perfect. 
The only reason why I visit the festival is in order to get Ken's dialogue. I could have gathered the sweet pea at the merchant's stop as well. I always try not to, but I keep doing it. Even if I say, yeah, usually it isn't re really helpful now that I've come this far with money-wise. But they make good presents still. Okay. Thank you. Uh, I still have room. Okay. Okay. A burglar's ring? Monsters have a greater chance of dropping loot? Ooh. And a vampire ring. Gain a little health every time you slay a monster. Oh, you get two rings for completing the guild quest? Nine of my slimes are doomed to die. Nine of my slimes are doomed to die. And I will not hesitate to do it. Bus stop. Nine of them will go away. Hmm. Let's see. I'm going to try and get some greenies. Nope, and avoid the pink, the violet ones. Ah. This one kept. That should have been nine of them, I guess. Yep. Oh. It should have been nine. Yep. It should have been nine. Are you kidding me? It doesn't work in... It doesn't work uh, when I kill them in my slime hutch? That means I killed all those slimes for nothing? Ah. Dance of the jelly has begun. Oh, come on. I just killed almost the entire population of my slimes just to learn that they don't count? Ah. Ah, okay. You got me, game. You got me. That's very disappointing. Aww. Okay. So they don't count when I kill them in Skull Cave. They don't count when I kill them in my hutch. They only count if I kill them in the caves. Lesson learned. You only have the slime hutch in order to produce slime eggs and unlock slime eggs and then sell the slime eggs. <laughs> it's so empty when you come in here. Ah, there is almost everyone. Hello! Such a rare and exciting thing. It happens every year. I thought I saw something moving in there. Something big, something dark. Yes, yeah, okay. Um, Vincent? I wanna see the rare green jelly! Where's your dad? Is he hiding somewhere? Oh no, he's with Jo- with Jody. Eh. Good evening, Psy. Hope you can find some time to relax before the harvest season. I've been harvesting. All the time. Every time the month ends, I'm harvesting. It, <laughs> that's the latest date. There, I just saw something glowing. Uh, oh, it's gone. Okay.
Magnet ring, glowing ring, burglar's ring. Well, I at least could have worn this one. Ah, okay. Yeah, let's start the festival. Everyone else just says the same thing. So, there's no real point in talking to them. Once you have heard it once, you have heard everything. Maybe talk to Linus. I'll just sneak up when the jellies arrive. I don't want to bother anyone. And Rasmodius. Hiding in the shadows over here. Hey, old dude. How did you find me back here? I thought I was well hidden. <laughs> Perhaps you are blessed with the gift of clairvoyance. Nah, just keep running around and bump into people randomly. And when I try to find them, they are the best people in hiding and avoiding me all day. Okay, we have every everyone. What do you think? Should I launch the boat now? Yes, please. Launch it. Where did the seagulls come from? They're waiting for easy food, I guess. I'm the only one glowing. Come to me, my children. <laughs> oh yeah, right. Abigail is now beside me. I think she wasn't beside me last festival because I wasn't married to her. <laughs> oh, it's so nice to see them. And babies! <laughs> And there's the rare green one. <laughs> Aww. It always looks beautiful. Seeing these jellies never gets old. The glow of summer has faded now, and the moonlight jellies carry on toward the great unknown. But they will always be there next year. <laughs> hmm. I'm really bummed out that it didn't work that killing my little my little ones actually did this that, that I this didn't really have the desired effect <sighs> I might I might wear it, but I'm really used to the magnet uh, light ring. Which reminds me, there should be a ring that has multiple... Oh yeah. The iridium band glows, attracts items and increases attack damage by 10. Iridium bar, solar essence and void essence. Maybe I'm going to make this one. We still have some time. Then we can take our banded ring with us. Um, I still have those, and the Iridium one. Is going to be... In the shed. <laughs> well, at least the jellies, the little slimies, uh, put some... Put up a good fight. Damaged me really well. <sighs> 32 Iridium bar! That's amazing. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Um, so, let's exchange this one and this one. 
Ah, okay. My glow radius has, has decreased. Maybe not, it just looks like it decreased, but it's the same radius. I know, I'm tired. That's okay, I noticed. Good, so now we have glow. The mag we have a um, fusion of the glow ring, the magnet ring, and, and an increased damage. I think there is a ring that actually, a separate ring that actually does this as well. Some kind of attack booster ring. I don't know how it's called. Oops, wrong chest, wrong chest. Uh, here. Okay. And we're going to place you in here. And just for safekeeping, going to place those in here. That has a different effect. Okay. Well, I guess that is all. It was very eventful. We learned a lot of things. For example, not that killing your slimes in your hutch doesn't really do anything in order to gain the goal. Uh, okay. Well, tomorrow is going to be a big round of uh, planting uh, stuff. So we're not going to leave our farm tomorrow, probably, except for buying a few more seeds from Pierre. Coconut, peach, wait, truffle. Where is the star fruit wine? There it is. Almost 40,000 for 13 star fruit wines. <laughs> 69,505 gold. What did I sell for the others? Okay, the sheer amount of cotton, the whole milk, the coffee beans. Uh, corn dog. Oh my gosh, corn dog is not worth the effort. Bacon. Cheese board. Yeah, no. Okay, but the corn dog definitely isn't worth all the ingredients you put into. You probably er would earn more by just selling them separately, I guess. Oh yeah, experiments, learning, and tomorrow is fall. <laughs> Alright, hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see each other next time to the grand planting. <laughs> and hopefully finding the Wally to complete the community center. But until then, see you next time. <laughs> Bye!